I assume you'll be filing some kind of an official report or something. Which is fine, it's just that I was wondering if I need to be in it. Do you have to mention my name? I mean, it's, it's not like Beast would ever see you report. It's just... Don't worry about it. The less I have to write down, the better. Thanks. I appreciate it. Well, here we are. Which one was it? inspectors through here very often? I don't know. What do you think? Never sure why they have desks in a place like this. Finding what you're looking for? I wasn't expecting much in here. But isn't this why you're here? Why you have the key? No, the key was just to be sure I found the right hotel. This isn't the room Lily was using. Oh. So, are we done now? No. The room they met in was 207. You have keys to these rooms? I thought you had a key. Not to this one. Hold on, Bigby. I can't just let you go into any room you want. Seriously, what if someone found out? I could get into a lot of trouble. You have to let me in there. This is the room, 207. But I... This is the room Lily was in. Oh, <sighs> fine. Well, that's weird. This key is supposed to open every room in the building, but it's not working. Beauty! Ah, shit. Beast? Big B? How could you do this to me? No, sweetie, no! Wait a minute! How could you do this? We've been together through everything! I took care of you! I love- It's not what you think! Please! You're cheating on me! With him?! No, no, Beast! I promise I'm not! I'm helping him, that's all! I'll bet! I'm sure you help each other just great! Relax, Beast. It's not what you think. Stop lying to me! What the fuck is wrong with you? She's my wife! Beast, listen to me! There's nothing going on! I'm mad! <laughs> Hey! Bastard! I guess I finally see you for who you are! Stop! Stop it! Is this you staying out of it? I thought I could trust you! We don't have to do this. Just calm down and- Beast! What the hell do you think you're doing?! You aren't even listening to me! She's my wife, Bigby! I told you!
my fuck! Shit, Bigby. What have you done? What? What is this? Bigby. Look what you did to the door! You can't just act like this whenever you- Stand back! You... you don't want to see this. Beauty, stay in the hall. What? Why? What's going on? <gasps> oh my god! Don't touch anything. Is this... is this... Lily met her client here. Mr. Smith, whoever he is. And then... Must have happened right here. Jesus. Last night? Yeah. I was on shift last night. On shift? Beauty, what? I'm not a prostitute, you idiot. I work at the front desk. I... so that's... Do you remember who rented this room last night? I don't think anyone did. Not last night. Maybe they have it long term. I don't know. How am I supposed to know? It just seemed like a totally normal night. How is that even possible? There's so much blood. Go lock the front door. Keep people out of the hallway. I need you to be sure no one comes in here. This is a crime scene, okay? But- Just do what he says. I'll explain later, okay? Bigby, what kind of a person could do something like this? That's exactly what I'm about to try to find out. I can't believe this. Do all the rooms have these same clocks with the built-in cassette player? I think so, yes. Where'd you get that? Lily had it in her hand. In case there was any doubt over who died here. What is that? It's a book about Snow White. Or about the Mundy version of her story, anyway. The whole book is about her? Yeah. Why is she in a glass coffin? This is the part where she's in a deep sleep, but they think she's dead. What's it mean? Why mark the page where she's sleeping? I think he marked this page because he likes the sight of a helpless person. It's about power for our Mr. Smith. He likes to be in control. What the hell? Like he can't deal with people when they're awake? That makes him some kind of crazy, insecure deviant. Maybe he killed her just because she woke up. Jesus. <sighs>